everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Emily and I'm the owner of The Aesthetic Dollar where I encourage you to take control of your life one paycheck at a time. Today is Friday and it happens to be the day of our big product drop. So we are launching some new Sophie binders, money bags, cash envelopes, and the Poppy Flyleaf is launching today as well. And then we're also restocking a bunch of really popular items. So it's going to be a really big day. I did not sleep very well last night because I just was... I don't know, thinking about it and thinking about what I still have to do today. And I just don't want to forget anything. We have a couple of hours. It's only 10 o'clock right now. So we are going to head over to the shop. I need to count inventory. And then I have some last minute things that I need to get done on the computer, like on the website, just to kind of make sure that is all ready to go on the back end. But I'm feeling really anxious to get that inventory counted. So let's head over to the shop. <laughs> Okay, we got all of the inventory counted. I counted it twice, so hopefully it's correct. I do normally put like less on the website as far as inventory goes than I actually have in case like a package gets lost or something malfunctions. And so I usually will, you know, like if I have a hundred of something, I'll put like 97 on the website just to like have those few extra in case something happens. But I'm feeling pretty good about this because like I said, I counted twice and I got the same numbers both times. So it is 10 after 11. So we have a little bit of time yet. I am probably the most prepared for this product drop or launch or restock than I ever have been for any other ones in the past. It feels kind of weird to not be like scrambling right now, but I'm hoping it goes well. It's kind of that same feeling that I have every time where I'm like, of course, it's my dream to have things sell out, but not too quickly because I do want everyone to get what they want. But I learned so much from the mystery grab bag sale that whatever happens today, I'm going to be able to handle it. I just feel like I've gained a lot of confidence just in the last year and just really getting to know myself and what makes me truly happy. And I'm just really grateful for that. But it makes me think about a trend that's going on on Instagram right now where people will talk about like how social media is just a highlight reel but here are some real things going on in my life and i love watching those because you just never know like what somebody is going through on the other side of the screen but it got me thinking like well what are some of my things because you can be whoever you want to be on social media you can portray whatever kind of life you want to portray and i always just want to be me and so I'm thinking about maybe making a reel like that i think it'd be kind of cool but it also got me thinking like well what are some things that people probably would have never guessed about me or like what goes on behind the scenes. My biggest insecurity for the last nine years, eight years, has been my hair. Every time I have a kid, my body goes through these like crazy hormonal changes. And I know it happens to a lot of women, but I've experienced like really bad hair loss and it's gotten progressively worse with each child. And I have four. My youngest is two years old. And with her, I lost about 40% of my hair it just like fell out after I had her. Like six months after I had her, it started falling out. And I'd say it probably fell out for almost an entire year. And now it's finally starting to grow back. But it got to the point where my hair was so thin, I could barely wear hair extensions. I just like hated going places and like even leaving the house because I felt so insecure about my hair. I have always loved hair extensions. And one thing that I have never tried is a wig and so i'm actually wearing a wig today and irresistible me actually sent me this wig and so i am partnering with them in this video but i have partnered with them twice in the past so i have tried their clip and hair extensions and their clip and ponytail and absolutely loved both so when they reached out the third time to ask to partner with me 
I told them I wanted to try a wig because I never have before. And I will tell you, this wig is so soft. I don't even think this is doing it justice. I barely did anything to it. It came in a beautiful black box inside of a beautiful silk bag and it is just like the softest hair they have a lot of really great tutorials i am not going to do a tutorial for you guys because i know nothing about wigs like i said this is the first time that i have ever worn a wig in my life and um not gonna lie i butchered it just a little bit which is why we're wearing a hat today so i don't want to do any injustice to irresistible me because it is totally my fault like i just don't know what i'm doing so i just need to practice a little bit more but i am just i can't say enough good things about this hair it is absolutely beautiful I put this on and I just looked at myself and honestly almost started tearing up because I just feel so much more confident when I feel good about my hair so I just want to say thank you to Irresistible Me for partnering with me in this video and just being willing to send me something to try out because I cannot tell you what it's done for my confidence like I absolutely love it so I will rave about Irresistible Me all day long because I absolutely love everything I've gotten from them. It is real human hair, which is super important to me. It means that you can take care of it exactly like you would take care of your own hair. And this specific wig, if you are a wig girl, this specific wig that I'm wearing is a lace front wig and it is pre-plucked, which is awesome and makes it a lot easier for newbies like me to install the wig. And Irresistible Me does also have free returns, which I love. And I just checked their website and they actually have a 50% off sale going on right now, up to 50% off sale going on right now. And this wig that I'm wearing is on sale. So I'll link everything in the description so you can check it out if you're somebody who like me is really insecure about your hair, I highly recommend Irresistible Me. They are definitely one of the more affordable hair companies that I have found. I've used a lot of different clip-in hair extensions over the last like 15 years and I will say this hair has held up the longest and still looks amazing. So thank you again to Irresistible Me for just making me feel pretty. Okay, so it is about 20 after 11 at this point, and I have a couple of things left to do on my checklist before everything goes live at noon. It's only a couple of things, but I need to input all of the inventory, which I will probably do in like half an hour. I just checked the site and there's 40 live visitors, so I want to make sure people can like look at the new products and the descriptions and kind of plan out what they want to get and not just like take the products off. 40 minutes early so I'll wait a little bit before I do that but I do need to hide the products so I can input the inventory and then make them visible right at noon and that's something I have to do manually I cannot schedule that so we got to do that and then the other thing is that I have a few orders that I need to print off so I was here really late last night but right before I left I did print off a bunch of orders that have come in well these are from yesterday actually so these orders came in yesterday and I wanted to get them printed off so that we could send them out before the big wave of orders comes in from the product drop today. So we do also have a few more that have come in since last night. So I'm going to also print off those packing labels so we can start with a clean slate. So when we come in on Monday, we can just start packing orders right away and they will all be from today and forward. So I think I'm just going to start pulling some of the products because I have about 20 minutes. So why not? start pulling some of the products and then we will come over here and get the inventory situation all ready to go. I just noticed I'm like seated perfectly that you guys can't see the ridiculous amount of trash behind me like anyway it is 11:51, so we are gonna hide these products and input the inventory and then wait until noon to make everything visible Okay, everything is live. Oh my gosh, let's make sure it's all working. None of my notifications are going off. So I need to check if orders are coming in. Oh yeah. I wonder why my notifications aren't going off. Maybe it, my computer's like, not, not today. <laughs> not today. We're not doing that. Okay, well, let's see how many orders have come in because my notifications are going off. So it's 12.03 and we have... 64 orders. 
Thank you guys so much. It's so quiet in here my, my, um, with my notifications not going off. I do need to keep an eye on the Safiano binders though because um, I have the same amount of fly leaves that I do binders, but I want it in order to offer the binder with and without the fly leaf, I had to like split them up. So I just need to like keep an eye on that inventory so I can kind of adjust it. Because if a lot of people want the fly leaf and that option is sold out, I can like adjust it on my end to like make sure they're not. So we have 270 live visitors on right now. Holy cow. Thank you guys so much. Thank you guys so much. Oh my gosh. Okay. It's so weird because it seems like nothing is happening. Like I feel like nothing is happening right now. I don't know. Sometimes my notifications don't go off the way they're supposed to. Let's check the chic wallet. If there's going to be a problem today, it's with the chic wallet. I, I know it. Okay, it's 12.05. And we're doing pretty good with that, actually. I don't know that my inventory is updating very fast. Oh, yeah, it, it wasn't. <gasps> oh, the Sophie money bag is doing really well. So that was showing that I hadn't sold any. And that's why I'm like, mm. I know a lot of you guys were excited about the Sophie money bag. So, okay, no, we... 30 of you guys have gotten one. I love the selfie money bag so much. Okay, so the A6 Chic Wallet with the flyleaf is, um, well, just about half gone. Yeah, just about half gone. So that's good. They're not selling out super fast. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. This is so good. Okay, so let's see how many orders we're up to now. It's weird my notifications aren't going off. Makes it kind of boring for you guys, maybe. Oh my gosh. Oh, thank you guys so much. You guys are like literally the best. I'm like trying not to cry right now because I hate crying in front of people, which I know I mentioned in my last video. Okay, so we are at 149 orders. It's 12.07. Thank you guys so much. I don't even know what to say. I'm excited to pack your orders. I will say that. I'm so excited to pack your orders. Like I might come in this weekend and pack orders because my kids don't, my kids actually really like coming here. We just, I have some fluffy little chairs for them to sit on and um, some snacks. And so they know they can just like watch snack, watch snacks, watch TV and eat snacks while I pack orders. Okay, 162 orders. It's 12.08. I am so happy right now. There is zero drama with this product drop, like zero drama. And you have no idea how happy that makes me. Okay, so I was gonna show you guys what my top selling product is today, but it hasn't like caught up yet, like it hasn't updated. Okay, so we are up to 186 orders, it's 1210. I'm gonna check my email and see if people have any questions or sometimes that's how I find out things are not working on the website. So I am going to check my email and then we're going to pack up some orders. And then another thing I realized I forgot to do was package up the A7 non-tabbed envelopes because they just sent them to me and they weren't like separated into sets of six. And so we need to do that. Thank you. At least you guys got to hear one of the notifications. So we need to do that too. So there's, yeah, a few things that we're going to need to do, but I'm just going to take you guys along with me regardless, but I'm going to work on my emails for a little bit and then I will pick you guys back up when I am done. Okay, so I just finished going through all of my emails and there really wasn't very many, just a few questions. I mean, this has literally been the most chill product drop I think I've ever had. I think a lot of that though has to do with simply just gaining experience with each one and learning new things with each one. But I was definitely more on top of my game this time around. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh. Um, definitely more on top of my game this time around. And I just think that that communication piece cut down on the amount of emails that I get just with like people asking questions. And so yeah, today's just a really good day. So what I'm gonna do now is just start packing those orders that came in yesterday so that when we come in on Monday, or maybe this weekend, we'll see, um, to pack the orders from today, we'll be all caught up. So let's go pack some orders.
Okay, so the kids ended up stopping by the shop after school and it just got kind of chaotic, but I finished packing up all of the orders that were placed up until the product drop today, the launch and the restock. So I got all those packed up. I have them in the back. We're gonna take them to the post office. And then I actually have a nail appointment because I am in desperate need of a fill. So I'm gonna go get my nails filled. And I'm not exactly sure how much I'll be able to film this weekend. We are actually moving to a new house. So we have been super busy just packing and getting everything ready to go. So I will try to film some of that, but if not, I will definitely pick you guys back up on Monday. Before I sign off for today, I just wanna say thank you guys so much for such an amazing launch and restock. Honestly, this went so smoothly and I'm just so thankful for all of you choosing to shop my small business. Seriously, I don't know what else to say besides thank you. So I will either see you this weekend or I will see you on Monday. Happy Monday, it's future Emily. And as I'm editing this video, I'm realizing 
I got so focused on packing up all of the orders from the most amazing launch and restock we've ever had. And I never really talked to the camera for this entire week because I was just so focused on packing orders and getting them out as quickly as I could that I just filmed and completely forgot to update you guys or just really say anything in general. And so the rest of the video is just going to be me packing up your guys' orders. And I just want to say thank you again for supporting my small business. It's truly just such an honor to pack up your orders. And I think about each and every one of you and the goals that you have for this year and this that you're setting yourself up for success. And it's just truly such a blessing to be in the position that I am in. So thank you guys again for for, like I said, the most amazing launch and restock. I had so much fun packing up your orders and never forget that I am always rooting for you and I'm always here for you. So that's it for me. I'm gonna stop talking so you guys can enjoy some ASMR, some order packing, but I hope my video blessed you in some way and I cannot wait to see you in the next one. Thank you.